Lesson 1, Identities, Single Angles. Example 1. Prove that 6 squared theta plus cos 6 squared theta equals 6 squared theta times cos 6 squared theta. Okay, now we'll start with the, the left hand side. So the left hand side is equal to 6 squared theta plus cos 6 squared theta. Now we'll change that back into the reciprocals. So 6 squared theta is 1 over cos squared theta. And cos 6 squared theta is 1 over sine squared theta. So putting this all over a common denominator of sine squared theta cos squared theta, we'll have here sine squared theta plus and here cos squared theta all over cos squared theta sine squared theta. Now we know that the sine squared theta plus cos squared theta equals 1. That's the Pythagorean relationship. That's 1 over cos squared theta sine squared theta. And that is 1 over cos cos squared theta times 1 over sine squared theta. And of course, cos squared theta is going to be 6 squared theta and sine squared theta is cos 6 squared theta. And that, which we call, is the required result. So that's equal to the right hand side. Therefore, the left hand side is equal to the right hand side. Example 2. Prove that 1 plus 10 theta sine theta sec theta equals 10 theta cosec theta sec theta. In this example, I will work from both sides. We'll simplify the left hand side, then we'll simplify the right hand side and prove the result that way. Okay, so let's begin with the left hand side. So the left hand side, just writing that out again, is equal to 1 plus tan theta sine theta sec theta. And I'll change this tan theta into sine theta over cos, cos theta. Sine theta on cos theta times sine theta and sec theta is 1 over cos theta. So this is 1 plus, now this part here is tan theta and of course this part here is also tan theta and that's 1 plus tan, tan squared theta which you know is sec squared theta. Now working from the right hand side, the right hand side is equal to tan theta cosec theta sec theta. Change that into sine and cos, sine theta over cos theta times cosec theta is 1 on sine theta and sec theta is 1 on cos theta. I think you can see now that the sine thetas will go out and you're left with 1 on cos squared theta and 1 on cos squared theta equals sec squared theta, which equals the left hand side. Therefore, the right hand side equals left hand side, so we've proved the result.